All right, hey guys, I wanted to go over with you the new firmware 1.31 that uh, Uniden has sent uh, the beta testers to uh, run and see if there's any bugs with and all the new cool features. And uh, we'll just uh, we'll start with the first feature is the mute button on the uh, cigarette plug now changes the display brightness settings. So that's pretty cool. Dim, dimmer, dark, off, bright. So that's one of the features. Also, one of the other features you're looking at is a purple display. They added a purple display and then also a white display. So you can go in the menu. Menu. So there's a white display now, which is pretty cool. So a while back, my girlfriend mentioned, how come Uniden does not have a purple display for uh, the guys that like purple and the females that drive around with Unidens? I said, that's a great idea. So I contacted Uniden and I said, hey guys, is it possible you can make a purple and a white display? And they said, yeah, sure, we'll look into it. So they applied it. And which is great, Uniden has is listening to the enthusiasts and the beta testers and applying about 95% of the stuff that we're uh, giving them feedback to on this detector, which is great. So Uniden is a stellar company, they have a stellar product, they have stellar performance, and performance is even better because they added the KA segmentation option. Uh, if you saw me scroll through the option menu, you saw KA segmentation, so we'll go back to segmentation. Menu. So KA segmentation. So this is just like the red line 2, 5, and 8. If you're familiar with radar detectors, you now have the option to select the frequencies, which is AKA, KA band segmentation. So you could say... Seg Exit. You can, uh, stupid thing. Menu. So you could uh, actually seg what you what the frequencies you want to alert. So I have two, five, and eight enabled. And we have ten segments to choose from. So that's nice. Um, Exit. So KA segmentation is uh, will be tested thoroughly this weekend by Texas CTG. Um, we have about 10 unidents to test. Uh, Uniden sent us a few unit, units, uh, brand new units to test. This is one of them for uh, KA segmentation and uh, kind of test the variance. Uh, KA narrow versus KA segmentation, KA wide versus KA narrow. So we're going to be doing a lot of thorough testing on KA 34.7 and KA 35.5. One other thing I wanted to um, mention was... Um, as I was taking this unit in out of the box, I noticed that the RJ11 cord was um, very much upgraded to a heavy-duty cord, which is nice because the old cords were pulling out of the RJ11 plug and were causing, it's one of them caused my unit to not work and uh, to mute on its own, which is really weird. So, um, <clears throat> that's good to see that the cord has been updated. Um, that's great for uh, the guys that run the corded units all the way above their rear view mirrors. But the plug for their, um, their 12 volt plug is uh, on the far bottom right, but their cord is strung over on the left, which puts a lot of stress and bend and wear and tear on these units. On these plugs so kudos to Uniden for listening to uh, the issues that we were having with the plugs and it uh, looks like they're gonna go with these uh, cores and um, yeah I'm just uh, still impressed with this <clears throat> Uniden R3 and the R1 and it's got stellar performance it's just impresses us in testing every time and I think maybe once we have seen the red line beat it on a certain occasion. The other times it just destroys the escort red line. 
And so if you guys haven't got an R3 or had a chance to drive with one, I, I encourage you to uh, get one and test drive it and see for yourself on the performance. Uh, in the meantime, we got the big test coming up this weekend. Uh, this Sunday, we'll be testing for seven or eight hours on the new Unidens and maybe a few red lines to throw in there. And uh, we look forward to uh, testing the KA segmentation, two, five, and eight. And also, we're going to be testing segment five and also two, five, six, eight. And just a lot of uh, other options to test for. Um, we, we're just going to have a busy day. So uh, look forward to those uh, results coming out probably Monday or Tuesday, depending on when Brainstorm gets it all together and uh, get all the, the data in and stuff like that. And But we'll keep you guys informed. But uh, I just wanted to share with you the changes on 1.31. And like I said, kudos to Uniden. It's an awesome company. Great, great detector.